today I would like to show you this extremely rare Egyptian wood carving of the god Ptah Sokar Osiris. It has a plumed crown with ram horns. It dates to 664 to 525 BC. It measures 22.7 inches long, so it is a little difficult to show without panning it. It's 23.3 centimeters at its widest point and 10.2 centimeters at its greatest depth. The wood has six different pigments that have been painted onto the wood in very intricate designs. Hieroglyphs are painted on the back down the figure. The wood has over 2,500 years of oxidation on it. The figure has been painted with mineral pigments, including copper sulfate on the face and the horns and part of the crown, and also with gold mineral pigments on the dots and on the parts of the shroud in here. The tip of the horn was broken off right here, but uh, just glued back on with resin the pieces. Uh, not a restoration, it's just was the original piece and glued back on. The wood is very solid, no deterioration of any kind. The figure's shroud is intricately painted in the imitation of the treatment with jewels and beads and ornaments that the mummy itself would have received. It was examined by a forensic laboratory back in 1998 and it includes a 19 page laboratory report. The examination included testing 20 different areas of the figure. This was imported before 1948 and has an excellent provenance. This is the finest example in the best condition of any one of the Patasso Car Osiris figures that I have ever seen. Just a magnificent example that would be a fabulous addition to any Egyptian collection. On the top sides of on either side of the ornamentation are representations of the falcon, which is also
part of the Patasso Caro Osiris carvings. Well, you can view this piece on my website at www.trocadero, that's spelled T R O C A D E R O dot com slash ancient artifacts slash. Well, I certainly enjoyed showing this piece today. And I thank you very much for watching.